young minds with smart and creative ideas, solving everyday problems. Illegal mining is rife in Bumalang, with companies battling to clamp down on it. Potential solutions from the young participant include a motion sensor created for restricted mining areas, equipped with accurate location. Maybe there's an illegal miner there, or, or illegal miners there. The sensors will sense, then they will send a signal to the head office of the mine that there's some type of movement there. Then the office will be alerted and the illegal miners won't know anything. For wildfires and cable theft, their machine can detect fire and alert land and cable owners within minutes. It's a sensor that detects fire and cable thefts. They just say in an area there's fire or any wildfire, they can detect where that fire it is and they come and extinguish the fire. And maybe they say a cable is stolen. They can easily check on the system where the cable is being stolen and maybe chase the thief. Other ideas include solar-powered water reservoirs and pumps, a smart house kitted with lights controlled by Wi-Fi, and even a job seeker app is in the works to hopefully assist with youth unemployment. We have realized that our society is struggling with a lot of challenges, high unemployment rate, crime, illegal mining, and so on. So we decided to recruit 50, 50 students who are going to participate in the program that are going to find solutions for real-life problems. So they have started on Monday. They were given the background about technology as well as on Tuesday. So on Wednesday, they started developing all the programs that you see today from the unemployment, employment um, hub program. So companies can have access within the system and it will give us a, a daily, weekly to a monthly report about how many people have been hired. And it will also eliminate issues where allegations are made about employing people from other areas or people who are, who are not part of the community. With technology advancing rapidly, these young people say they won't be left behind. I decided to attend the, the program. So it is a good program because I've learned new things. I've learned how to use technology. I've learned how to use like computer and computer science actually. The future looks bright for these young people and many of them hope their ideas will eventually become a reality. Dumela Machoho, SABC News, Barberton.